electoral systems are supposed to be ingredients of democracy to serve democracy to serve the right of the people to choose to associate to assemble and above all to create harmony in states that were once ruled by dictators dictatorship comes in all forms creation of dictatorship can be seen from very many angles another way of creating dictatorship is creating what we call negotiated democracy negotiated democracy does not build democracy itself but it destroys democracy because you put people in class struggle that this is better than you therefore go for this which is better than us and good for us all that is not the type of democracy that aristotle plato socrates if you read the book of the plato republic you will not find anywhere where they proposed any negotiated democracy but they proposed a democracy of transparency of which you can use stones you can use trees you can use sticks to count in a format of transparency the nature of negotiated democracy can produce very many independent mps in the next cabinet in the next governance in the next government that is coming whoever is going to form the next government, which I believe Raira Odinga will form, must guard against negotiated democracy. Negotiated democracy destroys the very basic of what democratic norms are. What are the tenets of democracy, therefore? It's freedom of movement, association, assembly, and a choice. But you are killing the choice. If you kill the choice of the people, is why you can see the voter apathy, the turn up was not the same like it was in the Rift Valley, in, in Eldoret, in Kapsabret. The turn up in the mountain was not because that's not the choice of the people. Those are the choice of individuals. Because when you give direct negotiated democracy to some people you are giving medicine to others who will say i am better than the other one you went through elections i did not so negotiated democracy is always the center the epic center of the troubles that we will see in our institutions for me on this great sad friday the day when Jesus Christ was handed over to Pontius Pilate and the Pontius Pilate sent Jesus Christ to Herod and the Herod sent back Jesus to Pontius Pilate for summary. Also wash off my hands. I wash off my hands in the sense that time and time again I've said election is in Kenya always bring chaos it is not out of vain but the way this election has been prepared arranged organized logistically equipped has not pleased me i therefore ask the people of kenya to take heart and vote peacefully despite the fact that the elections the arrangements were not adequate i submit and i thank you all i wish you a good friday good friday is a good one for all of you who are christians at 3 p.m the sky the clouds will change.